Hey everybody, uh, back again today with a new demo and review of a really innovative product from Nautilus Cajones. This is the Nautilus Floor Cajon, uh, designed to be played with some tabla or for seated players. And uh, recently my normal cajon broke and I've been playing a lot of music with uh, Indian musicians and live music yoga sessions, so I figured I'd try this design. I love hybrid drums, I love... Uh, new types and uh, designs of drums and uh, this really fit the bill. So the idea is it's just a normal cajon, it's about 14 by 14. Sound port here in the front, um, really projects the sound out the front a lot. It's uh, made of birch and it's got a mahogany bottom, you can play both sides, I'll give you a demo of that. Um, snares are adjustable, I pretty much leave them on on the top and when I want non-snares I play on the bottom. Um, yeah, it's great. I've been loving it. I've only had it for a day, but I've had a fair amount of time to play with it. And uh, I'll just give you a sound sample, try to go through a range of different uh, sounds and volumes and styles and stuff so you can get an idea of what it sounds like. Very snappy snares. Uh, the bass is a lot deeper than you would expect, and I'm not even sure that it's going to come through it that great on the uh, video recordings, but it's, it really has a nice tone, and it makes a huge difference whether or not you mute the head or let it ring. What kind of sound you get. Really good range there. Um, let's check out the other side, which uh, is actually a nice mahogany on the bottom. It's got this uh, really great grain right there, and I think this side sounds like a really nice cross between a conga and bongo cajon. Uh, it's a it has a, a nice mid range bass tone and a great high slap. get the idea there. And also the, the other way that I've been playing with it that I really like is if you set it up on its side, which I usually put it this way on this side, so what you've got here is a really nice, uh, you've got your snare and a nice sort of conga side type of sound on this side. also found that pretty much all the surfaces are uh, playable and you can get a decent sound out of most of them. That's me playing the back there. So yeah, it's uh, great. I've only just started uh, exploring the possibilities, but I think it's going to work out absolutely fine. The nice thing is you can sit in a stool and put it between your legs like just like you would uh, a uh, large frame drum, and it'll fit in the snare basket. Uh, you need one that gets uh, a 15 inch snare drum, uh, just because it's a square, you're fitting it into a circle. Uh, but it will fit in the snare stand, and it, it works great there. And I've just been having a lot of fun with it. Just gonna go ahead and uh, play for a little while and see what comes out.
Jati there from one of our shows last year. Put this side a little bit. a little more. I was using some Kanjira techniques on it the other day. Obviously, I need to practice a little more, but you get the idea. I think it sounds great, and I hope it's coming across as well in the video. Um, I just wanted to say also, I was working with Andy Skellinger from Nautilus Cajones. Great customer service, great guy. He's got a passion for this stuff. You can tell he loves what he does. There's a lot of attention to detail and stuff in here, and uh, I highly recommend any of their cajones. Um, so yeah, that's the Nautilus Cajones floor cajone. Uh, demo and review there. I'll put a link in the bottom so you can check it out if you'd like and uh, Have a good one